not only is art uh, didactic, um, art can be in many ways persuasive or seductive, but art is also transgressive. And the transgressive function of art is fundamental in a society that often shies away from the difficult topics, the difficult subjects, and the difficult conversations it needs to engage in. We all live in societies that repress and silence what's troubling, what's naughty, what's sort of um, in some ways I think threatening. But art has this way of provoking us, art has this way of imposing these silences breaking these silences, imposing these conversations on us. And I think it's absolutely important that we as a society think in ways that we often don't, imagine subjects that we often sort of shy away from, and enter silences that we're not often encouraged to do so, because in these silences, in what's disavowed, is awaits who we really are as a culture and as a society. And I think art has been great for this. But as people, you know, members of a specific society, we also have to push ourselves into the places that are not entirely comfortable. In silence is where tyranny and oppression really does its work. And therefore, well, the conversations that are often relegated to the margins, the conversations that are considered impolite, those are the conversations that are much more likely to lead to a more fair and just society. Mm -hmm.